All right, everybody. I am now at Brackley Beach here in PEI, and uh, we've been told that we have to park somewhere else because apparently we parked in a construction zone here. All right. As you can tell by that that little bit right there. So okay. uh, we're just getting our stuff out of the car, and now they're gonna park somewhere else. Hopefully yeah. things go well throughout the rest of the trip. Hopefully it's not as windy as it was yesterday. Yes, right here, this is where my grandfather decided to park. Because he don't care, do you? No, I don't care. Hey, hey. Somebody comes to take me? Exactly. You might go away. You're blocking a path there. I don't care. Eh. Well. Don't worry, nobody's going to go through there. Pretty sure. All right, now this is the beach we're currently at. I know it doesn't look like much, but it's actually way better than the last beach we went to that was crowded and windy. But yeah, they're already starting to get into the water. He's just going in there. How about you, get in the water. Get in the water, Jack. That looks, this water looks good. I may have to swim in there later. But for now, I'm just going to vlog for a little bit around here. Alrighty. That thing there, I had to carry this, and it is heavy as hell. I think my arms grew a few inches now. So, at least I benefited from something, but damn, my shoulders hurt from this. They're heading in there again. They just came back to tell me that the water is fine and then I should go in, so I'm about to go in. But man, I, I'm just gonna check the water here for a second. And I make sure. Look at how nice that is. <laughs> it's kinda cold. Water's kinda cold. <laughs> But hopefully we'll get used. To, hopefully I'll get used to it. Alrighty, so me and my brother Brody over there, we just saw a little baby lobster in the water, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. And apparently the water really hates me because I got sacked by it. Like the wave literally came up right between my legs. It was like. <laughs> it was really. <laughs> it really hurt for a while. It still kind of hurts, but. Yeah, it was pretty cool that we saw the lobster. He was just so tidy. Let's see what Jay's doing now. Jay, what are you doing now? Building a sandcastle. Build a wall, Jesse? Press of work so far. I should probably build the sandcastle too. What did you do? What are you doing? Hey Brody, what are you doing? Oh, he's jumping over his sandcastles. This is Brody's sandcastles here. They look pretty good. Jay pretty much made Arendelle here. Like a little sand Arendelle. That's pretty I'm not even close. You're not close? You gotta build him a swimming pool? Alrighty. And here's my work right here. I call this the tribe of the honeycombs. As you can see, I've made little huts out of sand here. And it's in the shape of a honeycomb if you go like that. And I don't know if you can notice, but I put in a few little shells as the villagers there. There's a bit of a stairs there. This boat is perfect in every way. I think I've nailed it. I'm sorry, what was that? Say that to the camera. Say the villagers suck! Ah, oh, what? You don't even have any villagers. Yeah, those little seashells right there. Are you done? Yeah. Is that supposed to be done? Yeah. 
<laughs> this is a little village. Friggin' beach flies everywhere. That's insane. What's a beach fly? Flies that hang around at the beach. You've had to encounter a few. Well, a few, since uh, we got here, a few people have actually shown up. A few more people shown up. And uh, yeah, it took a while for the sandcastles, but I don't know, maybe I'll add a little bit more detail to it. But for now, this is what it looks like here. I added a few improvements since last time. I added a little bit, bit of a bridge here for people. And I also uh, threw in a few more villagers there, and I gave all the buildings doors. This felt like it. And I also added a rock, just because rocks. Oh, he's gonna do it. He's base jumping. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna get a good one of you here. Let's get you base jumping. My little brother Brody's gonna be base jumping here, right over this line, right there. Or is it that line here? Yeah, this is where he's going. Well, it's All right, he's gonna do it. Start jumping, boy. Do it for the camera. Here we go. Here we go. And there's where he lands. Weak. Weak. Yeah, well, he tried. Now it's his turn. Here he goes. Here he goes. Ah, landed the same spot I was. We're equally matched at base jumping. Casey, your turn. Now my little sister Jay is going to do it. All right, see if you can do it. And then jump over that line there. All right, you got this? Yeah. Start running, Jay, I'm recording. Here we go. And she's gonna do it. Oh, she's way behind. She was a little behind. All right, she's gonna give it, a, she's gonna give it another try. Let's see if she can do it. Give her another chance. Here it goes. She's going for it. She's trying to win her tie! And she still lost! I had one foot behind and one foot over. Yeah. But they have to, you do this the back. I don't know if you guys can see it, but move over. <laughs> yeah, this is where Jay land. That was her left foot right here, and her right foot was right here. So she landed right between the line. There's friggin' construction going on right over there. You can hear the banging partly. She Don't you jump it. in the shot. Yeah, Quinn, your what? turn, you have to try. Nope, not doing it again. Oh, so you, you just want to lose? I'm not losing, I, I won. Just, I just beat you. No, you didn't. That's where your deal was. No, that's not. I just went again and beat you. I don't care. Oh, so I guess I'm the champion. Yeah, I guess you are. But I didn't record it. What? Yeah. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. I didn't even. I was looking at the crane Look when you did it. Don't you dare jump over my fort. Don't you smash it. That's for me to do later. I smash it right now. No, no. no, no I'm just going to jump over it. All right. I might hit it. I mean, I will. You managed to dodge it. Oh, you were Oh, I thought he kicked part of the wall there. I did? No, you didn't. I thought you did for a second. I'll kick the rest of it. Don't. The rest of the wall. Cause I, cause you know, I thought I'd add a rock. Don't, don't. You should record this. Don't you dare, don't be, yeah, do what mom says. There we go. <laughs> right where it was. No, it isn't. It, it is was right there. Wrong, you're wrong. You just lied on camera. Sure. Wait, let's go swimming. Swimming. 
swimming! I'm gonna run out. Imagine if I ran out my camera like an idiot, that'd be awful. Oh, I made it into the water. All right, Jay, I'm watching. What are you doing? What is it? Yeah, graphic novel. Is this it? I think I have 24 tassels in. Oh, that is nice. Better than my crap there I made. Yeah. The box is a off. I'm guessing that's the big one there. Yes. That's like the king of the ball. Alrighty, yeah. You pretty much made Arendelle in the sand. I know I've said that many times, but honest, honestly, that's what it, I picture whenever I look at this. Alrighty, now, figured while I'm here, I'd tell you what I thought of the play I went to see, and I mentioned on Facebook I'd upload it today, so I will. But, uh, yeah, I figured I'd tell you what I think of it. Like, I've seen the movie Mamma Mia, and I thought it was terrible, but the play actually made a few improvements. A few, but it still has some problems with it. Which is like, um, probably the, just the characters don't really have that much, uh, like, like, personality. Like, we don't learn anything about them that much, except for a few. A few of them do. Like, the dads have more of a personality, and the mom still has a personality. Sophie still doesn't, and neither does her fiancé, because he's barely in the thing, but... It was still pretty good, like it actually made me laugh at a lot of points at how well the actors were able to make themselves look silly on stage. You gotta give them that. A lot of good choreography. Uh, a lot of singing, except for one guy who I thought was kinda crappy. Uh, won't say who, cause I don't know who. But it was still pretty good nonetheless. I'm probably going to give that thing a six and a half out of ten on my rating scale. So, you know, and uh, I think it's a, yeah, it's pretty fun. If you ever go to PEI and you're in Charlottetown, I'd recommend going to that because it's pretty fun. It's pretty fun. I don't think you want to bring your kids a lot of sexual innuendos in it. And I apologize for all the squinting, but the sun's very bright here. Really need to put on my sunglasses, but I have no clue where the hell they went. Just figured I'd let you know what I thought of it while I was out here. Good opportunity to film. Okay, well, we're back in the cottage now. Had a pretty good time at the beach. I uh, got my back badly burned and a couple of horsefly bites, but other than that, it was, it was pretty good. Had a bunch of food, did a bunch of stuff in the sand mostly. I was in the water, I think, probably twice. And it was pretty fun. Pretty fun. Rody liked it especially, didn't you? What? Come on, say something. Oh, I know. Come on, something better than that. Okay, that's slightly better. Alright, well, he clearly doesn't want to talk to the camera right now. But, uh, yeah, I just figured I'd give you a little uh, vlog of my uh, final full day here in PEI. Because tomorrow we're just going to go shopping and then we're going to be taking off. So, uh, anyway, that's it. See yous.